Chris, co Coach mentioned you're hungry. Can you talk about your attitude a little bit? I mean, is it humbled you to, to be sort of bounce around a little bit here? Yeah, it has, man. And I, and I use that word, you know, to, to myself when I, you know, evaluate myself or whatever. It, it is a humbling experience, you know. And um, just have to evaluate myself now. You got to do two things right. You know what I'm saying? Come here with a, with a, with a, with a good mindset. Come here focused like these other guys are, you know, and, uh, and, and just come here and work. And so I want to have to. Well, know, when you had a chance, I can't. When you had a chance to talk to Pete before uh, signing, what did he want to know? Uh, you know, just what my mindset was uh, at this point. You know, and I, and I like I told him, uh, him and, and Snyder, is just here to work, man. You know, I'm just here to come in and give you guys all I have. You know, that's all I, I can do. That, you know, and uh, that's all I want to do. You know, and uh, I told him just like that. And, 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 but, have you, is there anything you've learned from this experience that you didn't know before they let you go, the bouncing around, the finding the different environments and how everything's kind of worked that, that you're going to take forward now? Uh, it, it was, um, you know, going going from Dallas, going from, from the Redskins. You know, it, it was it was different. You know, I wasn't, I was something I wasn't used to, obviously. But I learned something from, from uh, every stop that I went to Dallas. You know, uh, I learned from those guys. You know what I'm saying? Were, uh, Jason um, uh, Garrett. Uh, I'm thankful for the opportunity that he gave me. You know, uh, 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 Scott didn't hand up with the risk. You know, I'm also thankful for, for the opportunity that he gave me. And I'm just happy to be back here, man. You know, I'm, I'm happy to be back here with the, with the guys that drafted me, you know, with the guys that I call my brothers. You know, and uh, like I said, I'm just ready to, to, to get going and just help out with them, what they want me to do. Your attitude a little bit. I mean, has it humbled you to, to be sort of bounce around a little bit here? Yeah, it has, man. And I, and I use that word, you know, to, to myself when I you know, evaluate myself or whatever. It, it is a humbling experience. You know, and um, just have to evaluate myself now. You got to do two things right. You know what I'm saying? Come here with a, with a, with a, with a good mindset. Come here focused like these other guys are. You know, and, uh, and, and just come here and work. And so I want to have to. Well, know, when you had a chance, I can. When you had a chance to talk to Pete uh, before signing, what did he want to know? Uh, you know, just what my mindset was uh, at this point. You know, and I, and I like I told him, uh, him and, and Snyder is just here to work, man. You know, I'm just here to come in and give you guys all I have. You know, that's all I, I can do, you know, and uh, that's all I want to do, you know, and uh, I told him just like that. And, 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 but, Have you, is there anything you've learned from this experience that you didn't know before they let you go, the bouncing around, the finding the different environments and how everything's kind of worked that, that you're going to take forward now? Uh, it, it was, um, you know, going going from Dallas, going from, from the Redskins, you know, it, it was it was different, you know, I wasn't, I was something I wasn't used to, obviously, but I learned something from, from uh, every stop that I, I went to Dallas, you know, uh, I learned from those guys. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Jason um, uh, Garrett. Uh, I'm thankful for the opportunity that he gave me. You know, uh, 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 Scott didn't hand up with the Reds. You know, I'm also thankful for, for the opportunity that he gave me. And I'm just happy to be back here, man. You know, I'm, I'm happy to be back here with the, with the guys that drafted me, you know, with the guys that I call my brothers. You know, and uh, like I said, I'm just ready to, to, to get going and just help out with them, what they want me to do. Was, it, was there anything you felt like in this training camp you didn't show them? Or didn't? It's great to have him back. This is a this is a great man, and he's been an uh, incredible part of our team and for years. And, and uh, everybody loves him. We, we feel him. And we uh, we know him, and uh, we missed him. And uh, he missed it too. And we very mutual in that. But uh, we're through that. And and uh, we have always worked really hard to discipline ourselves about not looking back and not paying attention to what's, what's just happened. Um, and this is a great a great instance to do exactly that. And you heard his words. Uh, and, you know, I'm sure <clears throat> you hear from the, the coaches and the players the same way. Uh, we're excited to be going, and then we're excited for this week, which lends, leads me into uh, this is a, a huge opportunity for us to get to get moving forward. Um, this is like starting again for us. It feels like that. Uh, the chance to come home, uh, get in front of the 12s, uh, the whole week's preparation, knowing that we're here at CenturyLink, um, it's really a, it's an exciting thing for us, even, you know, uh, there was two games in preseason. We got to get a feel for it, but um, it's time. And so, uh, uh, with that, you know, it's a it, everything is looking towards today. And uh, making this a great day is how we focus. And if we do that, and then we do it again tomorrow, uh, we'll get ourselves on track for for putting together a great week. And we really feel like this is the start. And maybe nobody else does. I don't really care about who else has an opinion about that. That's how we're doing it. And uh, um, and so Chicago, you know. Uh, Imposes problems. 
Uh, this is we, we know John Fox, uh, we know Vic Fanzio, uh, we know Adam Gase. We know these guys from, from the past, and they've always been difficult on us and given us problems uh, in their style of football. And, and these guys, you know, want to get going too, as we do. And it, it should be a great matchup for us. Um, it, it happens to be Chicago. We're, we're thrilled to be here at Century Lincoln. So uh, we're going to uh, make this a great week and get cranking.